Hello people, so today we are going on an adventure. Basically, we are going to be starting this series of climbing mountains. Um, the final goal is to climb the volcano Cotopaxi here in Ecuador, but we are starting with climbing the volcano Imbabura, which is 4,944 meters, so just below the 5,000 meter mark. So you guys might be wondering, why, why Zoe, why are you suddenly planning on climbing mountains and volcanoes and all that? I've got this friend, he's actually graduating early so i'm in 11th grade and he is too but he's graduating this year and once he graduates he's going to be leaving ecuador and going to study in the us and he told me i want to climb cotopaxi before i leave so i said okay <laughs> but then um turns out i'm a i'm going to be climbing it with him and so is my family so yeah but i'm really happy that he got me into it because I was planning on climbing the Cotopaxi at some point before I graduated next year, just didn't know when, didn't know how. Before climbing that mountain, we each separately actually climbed uh, the volcano Pichincha, which is uh, a bit lower. In Babuja was our first big mountain. We went there and we joined this group of this woman who's doing a study on how altitude affects different ages, different genders, and all that, and so we were part of her study for that mountain. This mountain was actually really cool because of all the rocky parts, the going up, it was nice, a bit long. line for like two minutes. to the rocky part it was time for us to put on our harness and our helmets our harness we weren't actually attached to a rope it was just a security measure so i'm guessing that if we fell someone would have sent us a rope or something they didn't really explain us in details why we were wearing harness once we had all our equipment on and we added a few layers we kept walking towards the summit and at that point the, it was so windy we were freezing. The wind was really strong and at that point I only had my windbreaker on and it was the same for my friend. We didn't we hadn't put on our winter coats yet. We didn't want to take off a layer to have to put another one on and plus with our harness and all that it was almost too late. So we and we didn't want to stop and 
phone on the group so we just stayed in the cold and honestly that's something that I regret in the future mountains that we're gonna climb I am not gonna let myself be cold if I need to add a layer I will be adding a layer <laughs> kept walking and the rocky part I mean that's what made me start liking hiking because to be honest before this hike I didn't really like hiking that much like I had done this hike we had gone uh, this mountain called El Alta here in Ecuador and we with my family we had gone up to the lake at Laguna Maria and I mean I liked it but at the same time it was just so much walking <laughs> So having to climb a little bit in the rocks and all that, that made the experience really nice. When we got close to the summit, the GoPro stopped working for some reason. For uh, the rest of the hike, you guys will be seeing pictures. men and his friend inspiring themselves from Wim Hof, also known as the Iceman, and climbing mountains with minimal clothing. And going back down, we were running a little bit, our toes were in pain because running in hiking shoes, it's not the most comfy thing, <laughs> but it was really fun. I hope you guys enjoyed this first video of this series of climbing mountains. Um, we have a few more before going to the Cotopaxi, so we're going to be climbing the Cincho Lagua, then we're going to be climbing Ilinisa Norte, then we're doing a night shooting at Cayambe, and then we're climbing Cotopaxi. And I will be bringing you guys through all of those experiences. And yeah, that will be the adventure videos for the next few weeks. In between all of those climbs, since they won't all be like following each other in the weeks, you guys will be seeing like other craft videos. Stay tuned for that. And if you like this video, leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe. See you next week for the next video. Mm -hmm.